I was in the Navy uh, from 1988 to 1992. I did maintenance on our bombers, A6 bombers, aircrafts. We were actually a squadron that prepared pilots to go fight for Desert Storm in the Gulf War. I came home. I came back to uh, California. I went to work for a hospital. I had a really bad fall um, and a very serious uh, back injury. And um, I had to have surgery. And um, I got terminated. When they terminated me, all, my, all the benefits had stopped. Upstairs, duplex area, that's where I was living last last year uh, before I got evicted. My landlady, she tried to try to help me, but I couldn't pay the rent. I didn't have anywhere to go. I, I didn't. And uh, I just started walking. I was sleeping uh, in the back of this health office here, behind those dumpsters there. I was sleeping over there. And under that big tree over there. Yeah, we slept right here. And the dogs was running around. I spent six months uh, out here, homeless. It's pretty lonely. You just feel like you're a walking ghost. People treat you as though you were the lowest garbage. You end up having thoughts of suicide. You end up having thoughts of, of just disappearing. What difference is it going to make? What's wrong? Sorry. Oh, right. <laughs> well, Rhonda. She was like an angel. When I told her my story, right away she responded to the story. And she understood. She was willing to help me. And she was like, okay, no more fear. Uh, I got it. Uh, you know, whatever you need. I'm really happy. And I'm really grateful and appreciative. Thanks to the United Way, I'm getting ready to move into my home and go back to school and get back into the workforce.